Hey guys, Amy here from Tim and Amy's Homestead. We are going to take a little trip to the bathroom today and I'm going to show you our composting toilet. Tim built us one a while back and I was very, very skeptical about using that thing. Well, it's confession time. The confession is I'd rather use a composting toilet than a regular one any day. Let's go back and see the composting toilet. And here it is, our composting toilet. Like I said, Tim built this a little while ago and I think he did a really good job. We went to Lowe's one day and bought some wood and a bucket with a lid and a toilet seat and was able to get it all right there so we didn't have to run from store to store to get it and got us that little bucket over there and that's what I keep my shavings in you can go to your local lumber yard and ask them can you get some shavings from them and they'll probably give them to you for free I don't have that here so um, I'm not far from a Walmart actually so I go and get the pine shavings in the really big bag and I use those which I'm OCD in because I didn't realize when I opened it I opened it upside down and that totally drives me nuts so I've got to get it put in a bucket or either a big um, trash can because you know in the winter time the mice might get in and want to bed in that and that's a big no-no we don't want any of that but um, I do use that in mine and also save coffee grounds and use in that as well you know with this composting toilet it saves so much water because you know what you don't have to use water in a composting toilet you don't have to worry about plumbing. You don't have to worry about a plumber coming to fix your toilet. You don't have to worry about the septic man coming to drain the septic tank out because you don't have any of that. It's clean, it's easy to use, and there's no smell. Yes, I said no smell. Of course, you know, when you're down here doing your business, of course you're gonna have the smell but when you cover it with your shavings and with your um, coffee grounds that I like to use the smell goes away you don't have to worry about coming into the bathroom and there being an odor because there is none unlike when you go to your toilets at home or at a store oh god I hate those things and I won't say what store it is, but every time you go in there and use it, and if you're still sitting and you flush a toilet, that burst comes up and the water flies and hits your fanny. I can't stand that. And you think about people using their toilets and flushing. And you flushing all day long. How much water are you actually using? You can imagine it's over 20 gallons of water in a day think of all the water you could be saving if you're using the compost toilet I mean you could be using that water for washing your clothes or cooking or whatever you know oh god and you know when you fill up your compost when you fill up your bucket you put a lid on it you can set it to the side and wait for another one to fill up you know have you a stack of buckets it's just two of us so we've probably got four buckets so when we get a couple filled you know go in the back of your lot create you a place to make compost you go and dump your buckets go put you some yard waste on top and just let it stack up and then over a year or more you can start using that compost 
around different things in your yard. Believe it or not, you can use it in your garden. I have seen many pictures of that and oh my gosh, they show the most beautiful vegetables. The vegetable plants. They are so pretty. And people cannot believe if you didn't tell them they wouldn't know it. The vegetables that they were eating where the fertilizer come from. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to show you my cute little toilet there. And it's so much cleaner. And I absolutely love it. I'm not going to sit beside my other toilet like that. And I'll tell you, um, I'm going to move you right over here. It's still there. But anyway, I'm not going to take it out because it was already here. And I got that. And the cutest little bucket right there. I got that from Walmart. It's a little ice bucket. It was 10 bucks. And it's, um, of course, it's not going to come apart. So I got the little ice bucket and I kept the little um, thing in there so that way I can pull this out and go run it in my bag, fill the shavings up and throw it back in there. And it come with a scoop. It was like 10 bucks for that. And I just thought it was cute. Anyway, here we go. See, that's our composting toilet. That's how it starts. Just put you some shavings in the bottom and you're good to go. Put the shavings down and then it's just time to wait. When your body tells you it's time to go, go sit on it. Get you a newspaper. Get you a magazine. Sit there and read while you're doing your business. <laughs> and then cover it up and go on about your way. You don't have to worry about flushing and hoping it doesn't run over, because it's not. Anyway, thank you so much for stopping by and visiting today. I just wanted to tell you about our composting toilet. And I hope that somebody will view and decide that they want to make one themselves. And if you do, please comment and let me hear about it. I would love to hear about your new composting experience because this was new for me and I absolutely love it and I wanted to share it for somebody else. Y'all have a blessed day and see you on the next video. And don't forget, if you haven't subscribed and you're new to the channel, please mash that subscribe button. We would love to have you on our channel to be able to view more videos. Thank you so much for stopping by and see ya!